Come on, are you ready, Adolf? <laughs> yeah, my, my hair's looking a bit third right today, but <laughs> I'm trying to grow it out, so you have to just deal with it. I've swept it over. Let's get inside. It's, it's raining. It's Manchester, so of course it's raining. suicide sauce? I don't like the sound of that. Today we're at uh, Sweet Diner, which is in, is this technically Manchester? Uh, yeah, I'm Manchester. I think that's where they filmed The Touch of Frost. You? You are joking. Years ago, maybe not. But uh, we're taking on their uh, challenge. I don't know what it's called. It's two burgers, pretty much. Uh, a bunch of delicious smelling Indian foods. Some, uh, some wedges and stuff like that. You get 30 minutes to do it. Has anyone done it so far. Yeah. Somebody else done it. Yeah. Is there like a record time or anything or? Not sure. I'll beat it anyway, no boogie. Uh, 30 <laughs> minutes to do it. If you finish, what do you get? You just get the meal free? Yeah. No right. sweet t-shirt yeah, or anything? Cool. I think you get a photo actually and a t-shirt. Oh, a okay. photograph and a sweet t-shirt. Sweet t-shirt from Sweet Diner. <laughs> right, um, yeah, so um, whenever you're ready, I'm, I'm, I'm good. Yeah, so three, two, one. Okay, I don't know what spicy it is. I'm gonna start. <laughs> All of it, oh my god, no. It's time! What's up, Bit Army? Welcome back to, you guessed it, another restaurant challenge. Such a beautiful facial expression. Uh, we'll get into the constituents of the meal in a second, but this burger is covered in Naga ghost chili sauce. For a second, I thought the spice was gonna ramp up. It's not brutally spicy yet, anyway. Can we get some uh, hot sauce over here, please? Ha ha ha, very funny, Mrs. Beard. Uh, anyway, this challenge is kind of a double ender or double header, it probably sounds <laughs> better. Uh, but it's kind of partially volume, it's about five pounds. And partially, it's spicy, right? The burger has uh, ghost chili sauce on there, and they use something called suicide sauce on the wings. One of them is a beef burger, and one of them is like a beef and chicken, fried chicken burger. But the last one was topped with like a, a tandoori, like chicken mix, which is really, really nice. This burger is big. I'm gonna deconstruct it. So this challenge is kind of a, an assortment of different things from the menu. The first burger was called the Kashmiri Zing Burger, which had the ghost chili sauce on there. This I think they call the King Kong Burger, which is just a, a fairly large burger. Yeah. Nachos with salsa is about as exotic as Mrs. Beard gets. Mrs. Beard trying some salsa. Brave soul. Anyway, the rest of the stuff on the plate is uh, nachos, some uh, wedges, some tandoori lamb kebabs, and smack your mama hot wings. No, you know what? This is so delicious. I'm really enjoying this because it's so different to what you normally get that I'm just, I'm, there's no chance of me rushing this. It looks really nice. Yeah, I've got to say, this meal was so different and so delicious despite being spicy. It gets spicier in a second with the hot wings too. But, um, yeah, it was really good. I guess this... <coughs> oh, every now and then you get a kick of spice. I guess this is um, imitation bacon, because everything else is halal. Does it taste like this? Yummy. It tastes, it tastes good. I told bad jokes. Anyway, we're uh, what about halfway through now. You get 30 minutes to finish this, and the prize package is pretty cool. You get the meal free, 
a t-shirt spot on the wall of fame, and a, uh, a snapback. Although the waitress at the beginning didn't seem to know that. So this is like a mildly spiced lamb kebab, I think. Lamb chop even, not kebab. Honestly, this is one of the nicest food channels I've done this year so far. Even though the first burger was spicy, it was still delicious. Yeah, lamb kebabs, equally delicious. And uh, I found out actually by looking on Instagram, the one person that finished it, it took him like 24 minutes. So that's the record before today. All right, I feel like these are gonna be really spicy. Maybe they won't be, I don't know. But... Just wing it. <laughs> Somebody make a stop. <coughs> these are quite hot. I guess this is the suicide sauce. You don't have to eat the bone. <coughs> they do look pretty uh, satanic almost, you know. Ain't that green stuff cool in there? No. So these things are the hilariously named Smacky Old Mama Hot Wings. I wouldn't dare do that, I love my mum. Thank God they're nowhere near as hot as Britain's hottest chicken wings from last week, but oh God, they are spicy. And these things are coated in what they call suicide sauce. It doesn't tell you specifically how hot the sauce is, but I would guess it's approaching about a million Scoville. So it's not brutally hot, but it's unpleasantly hot. The thing with spicy food is it makes me not want to eat. <laughs> so. Yeah, it impacted the appetite a little bit, but a lot like the uh, the boozy cow chili challenge I did up in Edinburgh, you're allowed to drink with this, so at least some of the spiciness is alleviated. Just eat any beer. Oh no! <laughs> All right, I'm trying to enjoy it. Give me a break, for once. Yeah, jeez, man, she's always in coach mode. Sat here doing one of the most delicious challenges of the year. She's ragging on me and throwing bits of tissue at me. I think I've got at least like 20 minutes left. Yeah, I know, but you wanted to do a PB. PB? Yeah, PB, I don't know what she's talking about. We don't even know what the record was at this point, but. Just finishing off the nachos now. These things are topped with like a tandoori chicken or uh, some kind of slightly spicy kebab mix. This is kind of like a, a diced up karahi chicken. I told you I think you've got Tra this. I actually don't want this meal to end. It's really delicious. Can we get a dessert? Can we get a dessert? I hope that was a rhetorical question, Mrs. Beard. Don't you worry, we'll be ordering from the dessert menu in just a second because this place is called Sweet Diner for a reason. It actually specializes in desserts. They just do other foods too. Wow. <laughs> there you go. Is that okay? Yeah. Like, <laughs> the way that you're looking at me, is my beard a mess? So you've done it with wow, 70 minutes to spare? Well, it was delicious. That's one of the nicest food challenges I've done this year. It's, it was really, really good. Uh, can I take a look at the dessert menu? Dessert menu, of course. Yeah. <coughs> Can't believe it. Look, I ate all that food and you left your nachos. You got like 15 nachos, why are you... You can't have any dessert, you didn't finish your nachos. You didn't finish your nachos. Yeah. <sighs> There's one thing we're not dropping a dress size. At least I have got saggy skin like you have here. <laughs> Nice. Let it go, tight. woman! Let it go! Super tight, super tight. What are you talking about? Look at this sagginess. Ooh. Oh, I've, lost, I've lost some weight, Larry. Give me a break. Ooh, this is nice. It's not just a sweet t shirt, a sweet cap. Nice. I don't really suit hats on a And your dessert shouldn't be too long. Oh, oh thank yeah. you. No, thank you. Yeah, good idea. <laughs> thank you. A bit much, sorry. Cap isn't that nice, you know? put it in the display box. <laughs> I don't know, I used to wear hats backwards a lot, but I kind of had this epiphany at about 32 that you can't really wear baseball caps backwards at the age of 32. <laughs> but I don't know, I think I'm kind of pulling this off. And it's much better than the, it hides your hair. the hair underneath, so while I grow my hair out,
Exactly. Lick. Are you going to lick the rim? <laughs> <laughs> well, you have to wait for tonight to find out if I'm going to do that. <laughs> it's all chocolate. <laughs> and nutty. <coughs> This channel has just reached peak smut. I just, I'm, I apologise. <laughs> All right, I, I think that's enough for one day.